In this video, we'll cover some tips on the new Windows 7 taskbar. We click on the Start button and right click a menu item such as Outlook and select Pin to Taskbar. And a shortcut is added. We can also search for a program such as Word. We right click the item and select Pin to Taskbar. We can also drag an icon from the desktop down to the taskbar and drop it there. You can drag a file to the taskbar and the related program will be added. We can rearrange by dragging an icon to the desired location. A single click opens the program from the taskbar. To remove an item, just right click and select Unpin. Pressing the Windows key and a number key for the relative position on the taskbar also opens the program. If we right click on an icon, a jump list of recent files appears, and we can open Document 1. Now we open a second document. Followed by a third. And a fourth. Let's minimize all of these. If we hover over an icon, we see thumbnails of the windows. We can customize the taskbar by right-clicking and selecting Properties. We can lock the taskbar by checking the box. And unlock it by unchecking it. We can activate the Auto Hide feature Bringing the cursor near shows the bar Uncheck the box and click Apply for Normal View Check Use Small Icons to gain more space Uncheck the box to return. To alter the way task buttons look, select Combine when full and click Apply. Or you can select Never Combine. We'll go back to the default. By holding down the left mouse button, you can drag the bar to positions on the right, top, left, or bottom. Now you know your taskbar better. I hope this little computer bit has been helpful. Please subscribe to our channel and come back often to pick up more tips on Windows. 
Remember, the better you understand Windows, the more fun you'll have with your PC. Goodbye for now.